Okay. I'm back. We did Sony State of Play 2023 Poggers. And uh, and now we're going to do some Hylix. Going to finish the game. Uh, and we got some awesome art here. This is, as I said before, this is from Video Relax. And uh, it's very cool. Very well done. I can't help but think that I see the word slick in the background. I'm not sure though. Uh, but anyway, sorry, I'm like looking at Twitter right now because I think uh, I must. I, I should. I should tweet out that I'm that I'm playing this. Uh. I already tweeted out, I was like, oh, state of play and then Hylix, but I'll, I'll tweet out that I'm doing Hylix. Uh, but thank you, Video Relax, and another classic artist. Uh, yeah, I've got Slick Brain, sorry. More Stuff Game, oh god, it, it, no. More Stuff Game. Twitch.tv slash The Grapefruit. That's me! Uh... I didn't say what game it was, I should have said Hylix in parentheses, but whatever. Uh, okay. Now... I thought I was going to be able to bang out Hylix in one stream, but that didn't happen. But it looks like it's going to be kind of a short stream this time. I kind of... okay, <laughs> this is like glitched out, by the way, I don't know, is it supposed to look like this? All of our heads are gone. So I'm gonna finish this. I'm kind of tempted to go fight that guy that I was like struggling with too. Uh, I have no idea which crystal it was. The yellow one, it wasn't the yellow one. I don't think. And like, uh, you know, I might have to, like, go back... Yeah, this was... I think I found... This is... I found a waypoint after the green guy, but I kind of want to just go fight the green guy right now. Because I have this fourth team member that has the move that makes him, like, way fucking easier. And it's cool to see this area, too. Uh, it's kind of quiet. Let me turn it up. The, the, the audio in this game is just generally kind of quiet. Okay. So let's do that. I just heard like a huge crash from downstairs. Like Isabel's mom or something. It's like, holy shit. Uh, okay. So here's this asshole. I swear, I, I, if I die to this guy again, then I'll just go back and, and skip him again. But I figure it should be relatively easy now that we all have dark flame. Like all of us have dark flame now. So let's, here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to attack with Wayne. Samsnos is going to do detonation. De Desmond is going to do a calibration on Wayne, because that acts first. And then, uh, should I even use Dark Flame here? I don't think I should, honestly. Maybe I should just do a normal hit until he spawns goons. Because that's when Dark Flame is going to be useful. People were saying I sequence broke by, by getting Samsnosa first. I don't know if that's a sequence break, I think that's just like a thing that can happen. Detonate does use a ton of, uh... Will, though. That's the one thing. Let's just use Health Chant. Get everybody up back to full, because I'm going to use a Juice on Samsnosa anyway. Okay. <laughs> Beautiful. Okay, and now is when we start using the new move. 
Some Snosa was stunned there. Now we start using Dark Flame. You use... You, you just drink some nice juice, Some Snosa. I used up so many good items trying to kill this guy, too. It fucking sucks. Uh... Let's keep using Calibration, because Wayne got attacked down. And this guy can use... What is, uh... Damage equal to 25% of target's current flesh points. Damn. That's really good for, like, the first... Huh. Like, first hit of the fight, that seems really good. Dark Flame, let's go. Now we can do that move. Jesus Christ, it instantly kills his goons, that's so good. Is it still kind of quiet? It still seems kind of quiet. I'm gonna crank it up. Even that might be... a little bit, uh... Too quiet. Uh, let me know. Okay. How about, uh... How about this? Let's try Bubbles. Let's try making him queasy. And then I'll use Calibration on Pongaroma, too. Dedesmon is so useless otherwise. I feel like he's best as, like, an assist. Ancient Odor. I mean, I could still do Partial Destruct, but I feel like that's, that's a huge amount of, uh, points. Let's just attack with him. Ooh. Okay, now we just hit him with the Dark Flame a little more. Uh... Let's use detonation. And you can use health chant. Very cool. Perfect. And you use dark flame too. Uh, really, we only need one dark flame. I think Wayne's dark flame is doing way more damage than Pongoroma's. Or Pongorma. Oh my god, that was so fucking easy. Oh my god, that was so much fucking easier. Holy fucking shit, that was piss easy with Dark Flame. Jesus fuck. Holy Christ, that made it like 10 billion times easier. That was like, that was like... Did he have the same amount of health? I feel like there was a, like one or two attempts where I did like 6,000 damage to that thing and it never died. Okay, the red jewel is the new teleport. I feel like I did like a third of the amount of damage I did in some of my previous attempts there. It was just that I didn't have to spend so much time like recovering from all his goons hitting me. I have died a lot here. Right, these things like killed me. The statues, like, got up and beat my ass. <laughs> oh god. Found meat. Well, that's good. Okay, well now we know how to teleport back here, and I also fucking killed that guy. It's the red. I think it's the red one on the right. There's two red ones. Okay. It, like, Jesus Christ, like, I knew that was gonna make it easier, but holy fuck. That is, that, that is like a distinct, like, check to see if you have Pongaroma or Pongorma or whatever the fuck. I also just, like, fumbled that. It's, like, grid-based, so it's hard. Uh, do we have, we have full everything, thank god. It seems like sometimes when you die, it, like, takes away half of everyone's will. Okay. Okay, well, this is certain death. No, maybe not. Spam. Okay. Weird. 
I aggroed fewer of them. Oh, there's one just right in front of that. I need to, like, lure it. Okay. Well. This is gonna be just trial and error. This bit is silly. It's like Pongorma gave us immunity to those little, like, insta-kill skull things, but then now there's these assholes insta-killing us all the time. Please, God. I feel like I missed stuff in there. Hello? Are you a friend? I am the Sage of Death. I grant you my token. So you just token, very cool. That's two out of three. Seek my siblings, the Sage of Brains and the Sage of Death. They will also give you tokens, for therein lies the path to enlightenment. I like that he's got two fridges, and one of them's like out of the universe. Hot dog! I don't suppose I uh, can do the same thing I did in that one other room with the trash can. Like this. <laughs> oh god, this is fucky. Invisible maze. Uh. Uh. Muscle epic times two, very cool. That's a permanent up. Very neat. Jesus Christ, this one was a lot more complicated than the trash can. Oh, and this doesn't even lead anywhere. I thought this, that, like, going to the right here would take me somewhere. Weird. Okay. Well, that's cool to have. Hope there won't be a guy that just instantly spawns in front of me and kills me here. Okay. Okay, I suppose that guy's probably gonna get up. Yep. Is this something? It's a box. Paper cup! Ooh! Very nice, actually. Okay. These guys are so scary. They, like, move so fast, but they also are kind of dumb. Okay. I'm trying to move with finesse here. Don't think we've gone this way. Uh. uh <laughs> mm. Okay. Whoa. I'm this asshole again. Is this act three beginning? Nice cat. Nice kitty. Nice, nice kitty. At last the shrunken beast is approached. Below joyful engines, Wayne is mercifully castigating a hope out of pains. Castigating. I'm gonna Google that. Yeah, I think it's spelled wrong too. Yeah, there's no way that E is supposed to be there. Reprimand someone severely. He was castigated for not setting a good example. Okay. There's been a few misspelled words like that. And it's hard to tell if it's a genuine, like if it's a genuine mistake or if it's intentional. Or it's far beyond mere insects and theories. Our massive mandible will not be sustained. Theories is also misspelled. And now the time for austere tyranny homunculus draws to an end. Gibby, offending, calms grimly with the juicy lunar fortress. This corrosion extracts the jelly in the lard near the ray. Act three. Weird. <laughs> Meow. I killed it. Am I like the god of death? Uh, there's already a sage of death, I guess. Yeah, homunculus had like two S's for some reason. Like I said, they just keep doing that shit. Cause I gotta interact with everything. The fidget toy zone. The f fuck? 
Summon airship. Whoa. Uh. <laughs> Did I win? I don't think I get to summon the airship yet. Or I'm like not doing it right. Oh, here we go. Weird, okay. Uh, I think I've already been to this TV, but not with my uh, new crew. I can't even go there, really. Some of these islands just have nothing on them. <laughs> but I kind of want to check in case they got something secret, I don't know. I assume, like, this one seems important. Because there's no other way to get to it. There's also this. Hold on, let me just peek around at some of the weird spots. Eh. Fish. Shall I recite the music tutorial? What? Use keys 1 to 4 to play notes and key 5 to change, um, style. Or don't. It's your life. You can also coerce your bandmates into playing their instruments by pressing the spacebar while facing them. Try it. Maybe. Um, are you fucking kidding? He's got sunglasses. This is awesome. This is just like that one village in Pokemon Black and White. Look at all the people down there partying. Expand his contraband strand, and his crease and chronic chronologies ooh, thine surf his sloth. Those are the lyrics. I can switch styles with five. Play the clock song. There's tons of NPCs down here. Oh, there's a TV. Can I, uh, use it? Yes. Uh. Learned dissect. That looked like dissect. Pongorma on the beatbox. Oh wait, there's a chest here too. Juice pack. Oh god. This is my considerin' jam, yo. This is my exaltin' jam? She can really batter. I love this room. She can really caress. So melancholy. Some of these little goobers are just getting destroyed, yeah. Oh, brain. I am so rolling considered right now. These gotta be randomized too, right? So shriveled. This is one of the guards. I recognize a lot of these. There's a cone cultist in there. Whack. Very cool. Very cool. I like this area. Uh, okay. Th that was awesome. Fucking based. Some of these islands just have nothing on them at all. Okay. Well, let's go down here. Ooh, another cool ass looking house like this. I love I love the areas that are hand drawn like this. <clears throat> Hello? Toilet? Psst, hey, 
I got horse food. I might be persuaded to part with it for 3,000 bucks. How much money do I have? I got a lot. Let's do it. Let's get the horse food. Still never got the roach food because the game, like, glitched out. The contents are not useful. It's poop. <laughs> it's poop. Learned illusion form. There's, like, other TVs that some of my party members have not seen, too, but I just, I don't care enough to, like, try to go back and, like, find them all. Game glitched because I sequence broke, but I I feel like sequence break implies that I like did something like unintended or like like exploit the game or something. Like you can just walk right up to Samsnos's house and get her like that. Like hmm. kind of want to go to that TV, but whatever. And then, oh, wait, 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 no, I wanted to go to this one, the Donut Island. What do we got down here? This has got to be the castle, the, like, lunar castle of Gibby. Hot dogs or perhaps a spaceship key? <laughs> Bruh. I'm aware I got some Snosa first. I, I just, I don't, I don't know if that's necessarily a sequence break. I think that's just a thing you can do. Oh, this castle's tiny. Oh God. I, somebody's gotta give me 9,999 or whatever, or 99,000. Okay, well now we have Dark Flame. This is perfect. Just just Dark Flame all. Jesus Christ. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> that was easy. <laughs> Spaceship requires a key. Well, that sucks. Guess I'm grinding for the next 50 hours. No, I'm sure there's a place where you can find some. Fine, like I care. <laughs> okay, well... I still haven't- like, I got the horse food and I didn't actually give it to anyone. I feel like there's a bunch of stuff. You know, I kind of want to go... Beat the the thing the big worm thing and see if i can get more uh bella said that i could get more full heals from it if i didn't kill it that was over this way i'm pretty sure Yeah, like, Samsnosa lives out in the fucking, like, cursed badlands. I love this area. Uh, it's part of the reason I was so, like, enamored with this. Like, some people were like, oh, the first stream was, like, hard to watch because he kept just fucking around in this area. It's so cool. It's got such a neat vibe. Here it is. So... Uh, it actually, it doesn't look like those things actually are refilled. There's a possibility, I think there's one that I didn't like get because it was like right on top of it. I'm gonna try to kill this thing. Whoa. Uh. Really? Really? Wait, I, does it not have a hitbox anymore? The fuck? Oh. Okay. Yes, best background. Okay. So, what is illusion form? Temporarily change appearance, purely cosmetic. Hmm. Maybe that would- maybe I, like, use this in front of the shopkeep guy and he'll, like, give me the spaceship key? Or some shit like that? 
This seems like something that's like relating to like an overworld puzzle. Okay. Uh, let's just do our classic. Let's do, do attack. Detonate as some snow said. Calibrate Wayne as dead. And then you can do... Oh, do partial destruct. That seems great. Great for like a first turn move. <laughs> Reeked partial havoc. That's quite a bit. God damn. Okay. Wayne, you can just attack. Uh... No, health chant, not quite yet. Let's use detonation again. To Desmond, you can do... Can he do hollow pleather on himself or on, on other characters? No. Sad. May confuse enemies. Let's try this. R damages all enemies and removes positive statuses. Interesting. Dissect. I loved the animation for that one. Uh, let's just do this again, too. That seems like a good early fight move. Wait, did it do 21? No. It, okay, it's fucking dead. Good shit. I was like, Pongorma's 25% of its health move did very little damage. Does that mean it's very close to dead? Looks like it. 1,000 bucks. Meat. Chitin Jerkin. Parasite Crystal. <laughs> See, there's the other one. Deutoplasm. And the other three of these I just wasted. And the, uh... Oh, I'm glad I grabbed that before I left. The dogs are going nuts. You guys are just gonna have to cope. Just pretend it's part of the vibe of the game. We're dog-sitting for this dog that is, like... Fucking obnoxious. It's like the most spoiled brat dog of all time. And barks. It. It's not the one that's currently barking. It has this like. Look at how some snows is on a lower plane than everyone else. By the way, can't unsee it. It's like it's got the most shrill, piercing, loud, irritating bark of all time. And it just barks fucking constantly. Not constantly. We have to, like, treat it like it's a bird. You know how with a bird, you'll, like, put it in a cage and, like, drape a cloth over it to make it, like, trick it into thinking it's nighttime so it'll just go to sleep? We've been doing that with this dog. And, like, it sounds cruel, but, like, we, like, we, we can't fucking have this thing just barking all the fucking time. It's a very cute dog, but oh my fucking god. Is it obnoxious? Okay, well, you know, I think around here, we got one paper cup. And I think if we use this warp thing, there's a... There's there's one that I used, but there's another one. No, that one looks full. And I don't have to worry about these skull things anymore. I never even fought these guys on the ground, I don't think. And there's a TV to look at here. There's a couple TVs here, I think, actually. I think one dark flame will take care of these guys, but just in case, very good. We're getting a lot of money for fighting these things. Okay, let's take a look at the TV while we got all our guys. It's nice knowing that this is the last time we'll have to look at any of these TVs at the very least. Uh. I don't really see much harm in, like, grinding a little bit. Is this the room with the other TV? No. This is another sage? This is the life. No, that's just a dude. So what happens? Cool. That happens when I touch those guys. Very cool. Okay. I think this should do it, yeah. 
Very nice. Oh, nope, he's alive. This feels like Cruelty Squad, but Earthbound. It, this game does have uh, a similar deconstructive nature to Cruelty Squad, I think. I've gotten a lot of requests to play Cruelty Squad. I've even had a couple people like see me play this and be like, oh, you'd love Cruelty Squad. I've seen, I watched Civvy's video about it. And it did look quite cool and weird. Maybe I'll play it at some point, but I don't, I don't have a huge need to right away. That's the game where you use your intestines as a grappling hook. I'm, I'm, I'm gonna, I'm gonna grind a tiny bit here. Now that we just actually have a team, and I, I assume I don't need to actually uh, grind $99,000, but I, I could use money. Yeah, I've also heard that Cruelty Squad is very difficult and punishing. But a lot of games like that, all it takes for me to, to sort of get over that is knowing that it's going to be difficult going in, you know? And knowing that it's going to be quite an unusual sort of CBT type experience. Not CBT, but you know what I mean. Best background. Like, these things just aren't even a threat anymore. And there's no actual, like, leveling in this game besides, like, you get meat from enemies and then you use that to get more stats. And then... And that's just to get more flesh, I think. And then... It's just getting more party members and better equipment. And there's, there's also like, I guess the, uh, the water, the water that you drink. Okay. You know what? You're the last of their kind. Get out of here. This background is awesome too. Some of these, I wonder like how they even got made. Like no way this was actually a physical set. The game doesn't really punish you for dying. In some in some places, it kind of encourages you to die. Uh, but it does have... Like, you do lose the items that you use in a battle when you die. That's sort of a punishment. Uh, are they not taking damage? Counterattack. Okay. Uh, weird. They're parrying everything. It's a decided to parry. Weird. But how do you hurt these guys? Okay. Strange. Uh, well, fuck. I thought I would just be able to, like, grind my way through all these. This one's kind of unique. 69 vegetables. Poggers. Let's just, uh, use these. Oh, I healed the Dusmolm twice and left Pungorma to die. I love the vegetable animation so much, though, and the sound. Wow. Well, the Dusmolm, you're the favorite child right now. I guess we'll use one juice box. It's really not that big of a deal. I guess we can- these guys have full health, so we can try attacking with them. It seems like Dark Flame did good on them, though. Okay, it, I think it just sometimes doesn't go through. Okay, weird. Fucking weird. That would have kicked my ass if I had come through there with just Wayne. 
Okay, let's just kill these. I'll get the water and get out of here. The Desmond, the, the best thing he does is knows how to use a water cooler. Cool. Yeah, that gives you more will, not flesh. Okay, everything's fucking dead. Yeah, I get what people mean when they say that, like, Cruelty Squad is to FPS games, like, what this is to RPGs. Uh, and we looked, we looked at the, is the, is the horse around here? Where even is the horse? I got horse food. For he's. Let's go, I think I looked at the TV with everyone, like, a couple of times now, but just in case. We're gonna heal up, because we're actually all looking pretty bad. Let's take a nice four-person bath. Okay. Are you a haunt? Knorf? <laughs> Give horse food. Acquired horse. I got it? What? Outfits. Horse. <laughs> the fuck do you mean horse? Increases chance of preemptive attack, raises mightiness by 20 points. I got an outfit horse. Okay. I still need one of the sage's tokens. Horse. Wearable horse. The fuck? That's not what I was expecting, but okay. Uh, huh, huh. Weird. Okay, let's summon the boat. And I want to go over to this island with the TV on it because I don't think Pungorma has seen that. The fact that so much of the music in this game is like dissonant makes the the few. Oh, it's this island. The few like non-dissonant songs like really satisfying to listen to. Okay, we just need one more Sage's token. And I assume we can't look at this until they're all there, yeah. Very cool. When are they adding legendary loot to this game? Yeah, that's what this is missing. Okay, I think I've already been here, but I don't remember what it is. Right, it was the guy who said, like, don't hit the switch. I think we already did this, but I don't remember what happened. It's like if you touch it a bunch of times, he just complains. Roll prison prison, invisibly desired. You're a button pressing maniac. Take this. Paper cup, oh my god, wait, what? Can I just keep getting those? Is this the way to get infinite paper cups? I don't even remember where any other drink dispensers are. Do I just need to like leave this area and come back and do that a bunch of times? Cause I swear I already got something from this guy earlier. Hold on. Uh, people were saying there's an infinite way to there's an, there's a way to get infinite paper cups that's like really stupid. And I'm wondering if this is it. Maybe not. No, it doesn't seem like it. Maybe I need to talk to him. Leave me. <laughs> no, I think I just missed that before. It's stupider than this. Okay. Cool, the dogs are going nuts. It's like we already had a pretty annoying yappy dog here, but now we have a new, more annoying yappy dog. And I really hope that the previous champion of being annoying and yappy is like annoyed as shit. And is going like, whoa, dude, like Jesus Christ. 
Hold on, I think... In either the village or this, there's... No, this was just this. Yeah, the, the previous annoying dog champion is, is now having a moment of self-reflection. Exactly. I feel like there must be... a water cooler somewhere in here. Because I don't think I remember getting one in here. But I think I remember seeing one in here. We'll see. I have a vague memory of watching Isabel play this game and, like, her doing something in this area that that I don't remember doing in my own playthrough. It was something about, like, recognizing specific landmarks in this zone. Oh, wait. This guy. Space Shuriken is very cool. I had people being like, oh, go in the tent, go in the tent, go in the tent. I interacted with, like, the one thing to interact with in the tent, like, three times. Maybe they're just saying the water cooler, but that's the one I already got. Oh. That's not a heal. See, that's, see, that's so much more, like, useful than tent, 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 backpack, 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 backpack. Oh, shit, is this the brain sage? Must be. I am the sage of brains. I grant you my token. Like, you, guys, you can't just go backpack and expect me to, like, read your mind when it's something super fucking unintuitive like that. Whoa. Seek my siblings. Yeah, I already got them. Cool, so I can get probably a really good move if I had to guess. This room looks awesome. Look at the little birds. They're like actual sprites. They're like hand-drawn. Not 3D. Weird. So these are the things I need to get. Don't backseat or give detailed instructions. Which is it? Um, it's don't go backpack, 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 backpack. It's it's don't do that. Because <laughs> that is the least helpful thing in the universe. That's what it is, chat member. So I need to get... These three, I need to, like, go interact with these three things. Uh, I feel like I already forget what the third thing was. No, here we go. Good? Winning? Let's fight this guy. I think these guys will go down in one attack, yeah. Oh, they're all, like, right here, actually. Oh, is it, like, and to go to, like, the center between them all? So there's all three of them right there. Like, yeah, I do prefer no back seating. But it is, it is the worst possible thing to do to just, like, spam the same thing over and over again where I, I could not possibly have any fucking idea what you mean, you know? It's like, that's the opposite of helpful. And a lot of times, I think it's pretty easy to tell when I'm, like, explicitly asking for help, too. Okay, I'm, like, trying to, like, interact with the spot in, like, the dead center of all three of these. Hmm. Hold on. I kind of want to try illusion form. 
Whoa. <laughs> I'm the green asshole. That's funny. Does it just, like, swap you out with, like, some random sprites, basically? That's so funny. Oh, here we go. I hit use on that square, like, a million times. It, it wasn't... Illusion form didn't make me do that, right? I was, like, mashing A as I was walking around, but I guess I just finally hit the spot. I thought I did it pretty systematically. Yeah, we've got a travel crystal here. Okay. Well, that was nice. I wonder if we'll look like this on the overworld. Probably not. Okay, hold on. I want to peek around. I, you know, I don't think there is a water cooler here because the rest of this is just shopkeeps, right? Don't really see myself getting any of those. Take a quick peek around. Uh, this guy was the other food guy. No, he just you pay to use the tub, and then he tells you you stink. <laughs> uh, it's amazing. This illusion form thing is fucking amazing. <laughs> I could get another berry shield. Those are really good. Uh, they're just very expensive, too. I don't know. Uh, I'm torn because I still am wondering if I'm actually going to need to fucking grind $99,000. I find it hard to believe that I'm going to have to do that, though. Like, I really, really doubt that. It's probably just going to be some event where I, like, find somebody who has $99,000. That's a microwave. I can heat up some burritos here. Because I've still got quite a few. Yeah, I figure... And also, there's, you know, there's a difference between... I feel like there's a very tangible, like, easy-to-tell difference between, like, obnoxious backseating and, like, stuff like that where somebody's like, yeah, you don't need to grind for that. And it's like, okay, like, that's, that's just unobtrusive, useful information. Whereas sometimes, like, I don't know, at the, at the beginning of, like, the first stream of this, there were some people that were like, oh, you gotta get the go right here and get the first party member and blah, 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 blah. And I'm like, Jesus Christ, like, stop. <sighs> There are, like, some people in chat. I don't know. There's such a difference. Between, like, unobtrusive backseating and just, like... Good guidance. Uh... Okay. I love how much, like... It looks like this is a huge town, but there's really not that much there. Okay, uh, I just kind of feel like puttering around a little more just to see, like, some places that I've been, just to try to get, like, TVs that the new party members have not seen, and also to try to get another water cooler. So... And like, uh, admittedly, I do not remember what a lot of these locales are. Like, I remember this. This was pretty recent, of course. There was like a special room up here, though, right? Oh, I can't go through there. This area was slightly obnoxious. Like, I know they gave me a map, but I still... That's such a cool background. I know they gave me a map, but uh, I just felt like I had to check them all in case there were cool secrets, and then there weren't cool secrets. <laughs> I don't know why I targeted that middle guy with the Desmond. 
he dies in one hit from anyone. Very cool. Warm burrito found. And then I take it that that ghost is just gone forever, right? Got a microwave. Yeah. Um, meow. Oh, and I need to go to that TV island, and uh, maybe that's what'll get me 9,999 or whatever. 99,000. I just remembered I gotta do like the Sage thing. Sage 2019 demo. I think that other path up there did not go anywhere, so. Let's, uh, uh. Can someone brief me on exactly what this game is? Uh, no. And that's not me being rude, I just, <laughs> you're about as in the dark as the rest of us. This game is about stuff. Okay. So what will this do? Just a really good move. Learned Legend of Melting, the ultimate magic. <clears throat> okay. Uh, I keep licking my lips. They're like wicked fucking chapped. It's like this city up here has a water cooler. No, that was just, this was just like the weird puzzle zone. But I think this is where Pungaroma's or Pungaroma's house was, right? And he, I think, had a water cooler. Fuck. Let's see. No. And this TV we've already seen. Sad. <clears throat> mm -mm. Oh, here we go. Fuck yes. And this was the food that we already got. I think I will just stand here forever. Okay, I think we don't have any more paper cups, right? Key things. Oh, we do. We have another one. Fuck. Oh. oh. I really don't remember where the other water cooler was. There was at least one more. Of course. Hmm. Heaven, maybe? I wish I could just go there. <laughs> Wait, where is it? Summoned it to the middle island, I guess? That's weird. Why can't I just have it right here? I see, that's like the landing pad for it. It's like a place where it can be summoned. Uh... I kind of feel like I already got, like I, I slightly remember there being one in heaven, but I don't... I, I think I already got it? Well, we'll see. Uh, and oh, did I go here? I don't think I went here. I just straight up ignored this. Oh my god, I love the look of this building so much. It feels very Seuss-inspired. Like some of the architecture and shit just looks so, like, Dr. Seuss-y. I love it so much. Cool. Oh my god. That's awesome. 
Hey, Lamau. Well, no worries. There's one right here. Very cool. <laughs> it gets me every single time when you go up to interact with something and it just crumbles. You must be the new foreman. Check in with Clawman before you head to the lab. Looks like you're in the can today, Freeman. Rapidly I chill our science and I shun our, shun our shining doom like a mandible radiance. Time to bleed the worms. Love this. You're not allowed to enter the lab without Clawman's permission. <laughs> Lament our skeleton. It's a Dark Souls soapstone message. Well, I assume that's Clawman. Falsify. He falsifies near Flabby Wheel. Hello, Clawman. Nice to finally meet you. If you'll just give me the password, I can get you set up in the lab. Jelly? <laughs> I don't know. Uh, did you forget it or something? I'll give you another chance. What is the password? Oh. <laughs> There's been all four things have been different every time. I think that's just scripted. That's funny. <laughs> Look at this dude. Sonic Adventure 2 pose. <laughs> huh. Ultimate magic randomly strikes three times. This is fucking red hands. Uh... Let's just go... Uh, you know... Let's do bubbles. Fuck it. Let's just like poison him straight away. And you can do detonation. You can do calibration on Wayne. Pongorma, you can do. Poisons all enemies. So poison and queasy are the same thing or different things or what? Let's do partial destruct. I feel like that's so good. Chrome flame. Huh. Oh my god. Oh no, Pongorma's confused. Did Pongorma even do anything? Did he go early or what? It all just goes by so fast. Uh. Let's do health chant. Do detonation. Oh, and everyone else is too. They're stunned or confused. Damn. I guess that's why Pongorma couldn't attack. Okay. Uh, so let's... Are they still fucked up? Yeah, let's do Mystic Meat. And I don't think they'll actually let me attack as them, sadly. Sure. Fuck it. Can't really do much else. Invoked Mystic Meat. <laughs> that was cool. That was like the closest thing to like an actual animation. That fucking yeeted Pongorma, oh my god. It looks like that animation like came out of him, you know? Well, let's let's juice up. This seems kind of hard. Oh, I accidentally hit right. God damn it. Lark did play this, yeah. Oh yeah, and by the way, uh, I talked to Lark. Dude's in New Zealand right now. Uh, I was not aware that he was in New Zealand. I thought he was in Canada for whatever reason. But people have been asking, where is Lark, where is Lark? And I, I've, I've been wondering the same thing. Like, you know, where where have his streams been? And, uh, basically, and he said it was okay to say this, I was like, is it, because he told me, and I was like, is it okay to, like, tell people? And he was like, oh, yeah, sure. Uh, he was 
working two jobs to pay the bills and then got laid off, I think possibly from both of them or one of them or something. And then he just like fucked off to New Zealand and now he's got a new better job, like a solid job lined up for when he gets back. And then he's going to start streaming again. On like, a, and he said he might have like an actual schedule when he gets back. So that's the status. Yeah, good for him. I think he, I think he just needed a little like reset or something. And now he's got a cool new job lined up. And uh, so worry not, the streams will return. Yeah, what a Chad. He posted this fucking amazing picture to the Discord of him like with a hat on, holding a jar of Marmite, and weird little like action figure. Okay. Uh, how about you? How's our health looking? Pretty good, except for Pungorma. No. Do detonation. Then you use a burrito on Pungorma, because burritos are actually pretty, uh... Pretty easy to come by. That animation's so good. Queasy is just a synonym for poison, they just use different words sometimes, okay. Oh, I did it. Oh, and we got the money. That's only $9,000. That's 10,000 bucks, not 100,000. <laughs> you guys chill? Remember, someone levitates amidst revolving art. Is feeling above hope. That's remarkably mountain skeleton. Wow, so true, bestie. Alright, I killed him. Crudely texturize our spirit. <laughs> is this is reminding me of the beginning of the acts? You must be the new guy. The machines have been prepared, so feel free to give them a whirl. Look at this. <laughs> Am I gonna have to fight the things that are in here? What the fuck? <sighs> I'll never get tired of watching the machine do its thing. I select these spe specimens for their exceptionally high monetization potential. <laughs> I don't know what I expected. These guys gonna give me money? No? Uh... I can't, like, look down. Weird. I, like, rested control of the camera. Oh, there's my money. What the fuck? Okay, uh, that was more than enough. Holy shit. Oh my god. Uh, is this- how much can I hold? Jesus Christ! <laughs> is this for real? Um... Okay. That, cool. See you later, boys. God damn. Well, now I guess we go to the spaceship. I can easily buy this now. Hot dogs and spaceship key. That's what he sells. Uh, oh, you can buy multiple. Jesus Christ. I don't know why I would need multiple, but maybe I will. And I could go buy a bunch of shit. I'm kind of curious what this is, though. I feel like we're probably at endgame here. Like, I've explored most of the islands. Well, that was quick. <laughs> Very cool. Come on, let me pop it. There you go. <laughs> Just the random, like, splotches everywhere are great. New overworld. Huh. 
This is Bowser World. Pressing A on everything, or pressing use. Can I actually, like, go down here? And get to that thing? No. Just a bunch of ruins. Wonder if any of these do anything. Hmm. Whoa. Do you see the, like, fucking pixel perfect among us there? That is, like, shocking. When did this game come out? No, I'm actually just fucking with you, but, uh... I bet some of you were, like, scouring the landscape for the Among Us there. Okay. What the fuck? Uh-huh. Entering the palace is forbidden. Leave now or be destroyed. <laughs> you accidentally crushed it. <laughs> Simmery axe was found. Oh god. Are you all enemies? Oh. I just murder them. What the fuck? <laughs> I'm fine with that. There's a toilet. Juice pack. In, in the toilet. <laughs> Very cool. It's because I have all this money. He gathers with our burning sustenance. Sus? <coughs> dot, dot, dot. That's funny. That one actually, that, that, it keep, they keep getting me. <laughs> That's so funny. What the fuck? <laughs> Look at the masking effect in the background here. Very cool. Can I kill these guys instantly too? Thank god. Not that they're actually that difficult when you have fucking dark flame. And four party members. There's another clawman. <laughs> this part's whack. Turn back. It's terribly powerful. Whoa. This is awesome. Oh shit. This guy was in the, like, party house. This- is this Gibby? You dare approach me? My fates will rock your chemicals until you beg me to dance! Now hydrate thine sentimental microcosm. It is the last time you will. Damn. Vital statue, eerie statue, Gibby. Uh, so I've heard about this guy because somebody- I heard somebody saying, Oh, Wayne and Gibby are supposed to be like a waning and gibbous moon. That is all the information I have. Uh, waning and gibbous refers to like specifically crescents though. It's like whether they're... It's so hard to describe. But it's like the different, like, phases of the moon. Uh, okay. I guess we'll attack the- I- I don't have- I'm- I wish I had full healed before this. A gibbous moon is where it's full except for the crescent. Yeah. Exactly. So we're, we're, we're not doing so hot. But I assume this is the final boss. The dogs are going nuts, so it must be. We've got four dynamite for this? What, when did I get four dynamite? Fully restores all allies' will. Let's just do that. There, this dog in the background that you guys might be able to hear right now, that's the fucking annoying new one.
That's the like piercing shrill bark. God, look at that animation. Awesome. Can't hear him? Good. Gibby produced dancing gremlins. Oh my god. Jesus Christ. Oh. Might have an L on our hands. I, I almost just want to, like, bash my head into him and intentionally lose so we can actually come into this fight fully healed. Legend of Melting. Let's use that. Fuck it. Just see what it does. Damn, they regen, too. That's a cool animation. Yep, that does a lot of damage. Can't believe this guy sent out the Duendes against me. Okay, so I'm probably gonna die here. Yeah. No, I'm still alive. Let's just attack Gibby. I kinda just wanna die and retry this. Okay. Because we went in here with such shit equips. Or, like, shit stats. Can't believe he sicked me with the Duendes. I got so much meat because I killed all those things. Holy shit. That's so good. I also could go buy a bunch of, like, cherries or whatever. But whatever. Let me just check down here. Ah, oh, there is a cooler here, but I don't think I have a paper cup. Yeah, <laughs> sad. Dude, you're blocking me. Dude, I can't move. Dude, no, please, please. <laughs> I'm getting super claustrophobic. <laughs> please let me leave. There we go. Okay. I wonder if this will be... No. I thought it was going to like make a bunch of crystals appear like it did elsewhere. Okay, so we're all good. We're all feeling great. If I die to this boss again, I might go buy some better equips. We'll see. My fires will stretch your skeletons until you beg me to desire. It's like, it's like Mad Libs. Some of the dialogue is like Mad libs -ed. Okay, let's just hit him with the four dark flames in a row here. Maybe I should hit him with the quadruple Legend of Melting, but I feel like Dark Flame is just more consistent. Because the other one's random. That thing healed when it was at full health. Does it overheal or something? Hm. Okay. I, no, I, I really think, as a starting move, Legend of Melting might be better, actually. So let's go... I feel like Poison's probably not that good on bosses. Uh, let's try Hypnosigils here. And then... Detonate. I figure these things will die before Gibby dies. So let's, uh, what is panorama? May confuse enemies and inflict slight damage. Let's do that. And then this, this partial dissect or partial destruct or whatever. I feel like that's your go-to starting move with Pungorma. I should have done that first. Poison does 10% of max HP per turn. Holy shit. Okay, that that's good. That's really good. Okay, are they... I just want to see if they're asleep. 
The statues are both confused. Let's do Mystic Meat. Or no, let's do Health Chant. Then... Detonation. But that'll happen after. I was going to use a juice pack as one of these two guys, but I think if I do detonation, I should do space shurikens instead. And let's just do dark flame, actually. And then you can do... Let's say, let's do another Dark Flame as this guy, and then you can use a Juice Pack. It's slightly wasteful, but I figure this is the final boss. And then we gotta use our four Dynamite here too. Yeah, when in doubt, use Dark Flame, I feel that. Okay. Oh no, the Duendes are coming out in full form. Okay, uh, you know what, fuck it. I'm, I'm gonna do, this is like the ultimate fucking like Giga Chad move. We're gonna do dynamite twice in a row. I wanted to do it four times in a row, but I didn't realize we were all fucked up. Dead. But it's still there. Fuck, the Desmond is on his last legs here. Okay. I wanted to do four dynamites at once. It, I fucked it up though, because I'm stupid. Okay, let's do health chant. And... Uh... Yeah, let's do health chant and mystic meat. Or if I do mystic meat first, that doesn't... I still don't get to act as some snow set, okay. The Desmond is at one HP. Yeah, that was nuclear test footage. That was like from the first nuke ever or whatever. Cosmic procession. Oh, De Desmond is fucked. No. No? Is that like because he's at one health? Weird. Okay. We're gonna try to do another health chant. Uh, okay. I'm gonna do... Dark Flame. The one on the right is dead, it's just still there for whatever reason. Legend of Melting. You do Health Chant, keep everyone alive. And you do... I kinda wanna do Partial Destruct just to see much, how much health he's at. Like, that's- I feel like that's the only way, unless there's some sort of, like, spider mod item, I feel like that's the only way to, like, tell what an enemy's health is. Or maybe the poison thing, too. Okay. 366. Still... quite a bit. Uh, okay, never mind that he's, like, almost dead. <laughs> That was a really lucky roll with Legend of Melting. I guess the, is the thing... I think the statue on the left also died. So let's just go ahead and... Uh, should we just chuck some fucking dynamite at him? I got another dynamite? What? I started this battle with four dynamite, then I used two, and now I have three? This is stupid. I don't actually have a uh, health chant as this guy. Whatever. Let's just, uh... Oh, we gotta hit him with the frozen burrito. Three dynamites and a frozen burrito. Ought to finish him off. <laughs> Dead. <laughs> One of them did it. Oh god.
<laughs> Holy shit. EXP. EXP? Is that like a mechanic? What? Wayne is now level 63. This game doesn't have leveling, right? What the fuck? It's a joke. It's a joke. <laughs> when you beat the final guy, you get all the EXP that exists in the game and go to level 63. <laughs> Ugh, so I am defeated. Wayne, I'm sorry about everything. <gasps> By the way, I set this moon to explode when I die. Say your prayers and soak your sciences. It's sort of like memory text. The dogs are going ape shit. Escape sequence. Weird, the crystal is broken. It's just got like water inside it. Oh, that's so weird. That's awesome. But Wayne, small, remarkably adrift, considers the ocean far beyond the microcosm government. Inside the tyrannies, a chemical res rescues partially. So may our doom witness amidst feelings. So ends the tale of the haughty texts, who sought to roll so sort of slowly, deceived her furnace. Well, that's it, I think. The end! <laughs> <laughs> There's just a bunch of, like, splatter all over. Oh, that was awesome. I'm sorry the dogs are going ape shit in the background. <laughs> oh? Th yeah, this was the screen with the button guy, and these little yellow lumps were there the whole time. That's the lever that he told us not to push. Oh my god. <laughs> oh. Okay. Wow. Weird. And we can still, like, go around and do stuff, but there's not really much point to doing it. it spells Duende. Oh god. Oh god? Oh god? Oh, that's it. <laughs> That's how you get to the credits, is you flip the switch a million times. With apologies, too. I bet that's, like, special thanks. That's so funny. Game settings by yourself. Oh, no, these are... Weird. I don't know what these are. These are, like, scripts that he stole? I think, like, RPG Maker scripts? Weird. Thanks. <laughs> oh shit, it's the guy that was in like the acts. Well, that's it. There isn't anything more. Shall we return to the main menu? Okay, let's just chill out here for a while. The castle is just, or the, no, the spaceship is gone, I see. Check the stats, oh god. <laughs> That's so fucked! Our stats are like, unbelievable now. I was gonna- I was trying to go to the music island. I forget where... I can actually, like, summon the- or I think I can do it on the first island, yeah. 
I have that was the first thing that came to mind, guys. Jesus Christ. And I, just real quick, I want to pop back in here. I want to heal up and see exactly how much our full stats are. Damn. Yeah, those are some pretty good stats. Those roaches will remain unfed for all time. Stop. Okay. Right, but the ship goes in the center. I keep forgetting that the ship... How the ship works. The airship. Here we are. My cool sunglasses. <laughs> we already got this one, right? Yeah. This was dissect. Because it kind of looks like you're dissecting something. <laughs> oh wait, let's talk to the guy that looks like Gibby here. She can really hydrate. Okay, dude. Well, I kind of thought there might be something different here. I think people just wanted, uh, wanted me to go here because it's fucking based. Very cool. <laughs> Very cool. Can I put all four of them at the same time? <laughs> okay, uh, well, I, I feel the need to go talk to the guy to bring me back to the title screen, even though it's probably just going to take me back to the title screen and do nothing else. So th it, that's, th that's your dance party credits scene from, like, Shrek. The end. Cool. Very cool game. Very, very, very cool. That was just... <laughs> that was just so... So unique. So special. And uh, people have been asking, will I play the second one? Yes. Will I play it straight away? Probably no. I'm probably good for now. But I've, I've heard a lot of the second game's soundtrack, and I can tell you I'm probably going to enjoy it. Uh, this is a one-of-a-kind one experience, though. Except maybe the sequel. And there's going to be a third one, too. So, uh, we can look forward to that. I don't know. This game was just, like... Bathing in a pool of custard. I don't know. It's just it's so unlike anything else I'd ever played. Even though it's an RPG, it's a, it's an RPG maker, <laughs> four party member RPG, but uh, just got a lot of personality. Very funny game. I was sort of shocked at how funny it was. Just a lot of like weird little jokes, and I just love seeing all the crazy claymation stuff. Very cool. And I think it's it's so rough, but like I think the roughness is like part of the experience. Like that's part of what makes it so unique. Okay, well, the dogs are never gonna shut up, so I should probably get out of y'all's hair. Uh, what do you say we go raid somebody?
I just want to like hook up my brain to like fucking like communicate with a dog and just be like, why are you barking? I just want to ask like, like get, get a dog, like the ability, like the fucking like the thing from up that like allows dogs to talk, you know? And just be like, why are you, why do you do that so much? Why? Why do you decide to do that? What is it that you think you're accomplishing when you're doing that? I'm just curious. Like, I'm legitimately just curious. Maybe they just don't have a reason at all and they just, it's just, they just do it and they just don't realize that it's the most obnoxious thing on the planet. Uh, anyway. Two different streams today, so that's, that's plenty. We're out of here. Uh, and, uh, who, who are we raiding? Is anybody even streaming? Uh... Nobody that I follow. You wanna read a pizza tower streamer? Let's go raid a pizza tower streamer. I don't know, I don't even really see anyone. Stir is streaming tabletop RPGs. So yeah, sorry about the dogs. It's just a thing we're gonna have to deal with for like the next month. Some streams, I'm sure they won't show up at all. Like some streams, I'm sure we won't even hear them at all, but they've just lately just been like, yeah, Grapefruit's streaming, so let's like bark a shit ton. <laughs> uh, Let's see, God, everybody playing Pizza Tower always has like fucking VTuber avatars. Zaza- oh, you know what? Lazy Matman, who raided us the other day when I was playing Isaac, is now playing Pizza Tower. Let's go raid him. Fuck it. Raid Lazy Matman. Zaza Tower, 101 under 4 hours attempts. True God Gamer. Let's go raid him. That works out perfectly. Uh, so thank you for watching. What a special game. That was fun. And uh, I'll play the sequel at some point. Maybe no time soon, maybe very soon. We'll see. So long.